that the guys have been busy working away here installing your K-caps. These are a brilliant little product that you've got here. You know, it's cost effective because you've got no brushes with bitumen. You've got no wastage whatsoever. You buy the amount that you're going to use. Yeah. If you're an avid watcher of our channel, you will have seen that we visited the Construction Week at the NEC a few weeks ago, and Tony and Dow met up with this wonderful guy, Kev, from KCAPS, and he showed them this fantastic product, and he's joining us on site today to show us how they're installed and the uses, and just basically give us a general overview about this fantastic product. Hi Kev, nice to meet you. Nice Welcome to meet you, to nice to meet you, nice to meet you. So, you've seen that the guys have been busy working away here, installing your KCAPS. These are a brilliant little product that you've got here. Can Thank you tell you. us a little bit more about them, where they came from, where you started? And the first time the idea came to us was back in way back 2015, 2016, when I was asked to do exactly what, what they asked you to do here was to protect the ends of the beams. I asked the, the building inspector how, how how to do it basically. Yeah. And he didn't know. He, he said there, there, there were two there were two methods basically. He said he said you could wrap them or paint them with bitumen. So because the, the, that job was my only job running at the time, I didn't want to buy a tub of bitumen. So I decided to wrap them. So a day later, after doing 28 ends, I instantly thought of a cap, but, but I sat on it for a few years. But then I got asked another three times, I think, so I knew that it just wasn't a one-off. So then I delved into uh, looking at how to formulate them. And There's nothing and like this on the market, is there? Nothing so, like it on the market. Yeah, no, did no, a bit no. of research. And did thought, a bit of research. There's an opening there. There's an opening there. There's, you know, the recycled plastic is another passion of mine. So it suited everything. It done everything that it says on the tin, really. You know, it's cost-effective because you've got no brushes with bitumen, you've got no wastage whatsoever. You buy the amount that you're going to use. Yeah, it takes use seconds to install it as well, doesn't it? Rather it's than like you said, wrapping all the beams individually and everything. Correct. And also, the regulations say that it's you've got to protect the ends. So there's people not doing anything, and there's the, it needs to be clear cut that the ends need to be protected, protected. For, for the benefit of the of the, uh, of the actual construction. Really. Yeah. So these are approved by the LABC. LABC. Yeah. And you're there at a show with those as well. We were at the them. show. We were at the construction week first off, and I think it was 2019. We won a couple of awards, uh, the best product, the best new product. Oh, wow, that's good. 2020 and 2021 have been kind of the, well, all three years have been great years yeah. to, to launch a product. <laughs> but it's a good time for that. We're still here. We're still here. We've got another size out, which is this size. And also, we're just updating the product every time. You know, every time it comes out, we just want to get more sizes out, really, to be fair. So we've got three sizes at the moment. Okay. We've got a 175 deep one, which is really kind of the northern market. Yeah. And we've got the KK0 one that does the 155 beam yeah. with a footprint up to about 128 and we've got this that does the small smooth beams that everyone seems to be liking like at, at the moment. Minute, yeah. yeah, yeah, yeah. They're easier. They're lighter. They're they're you know they're a nice beam. So perfect. So you mentioned these are recycled. They are indeed. Yeah, and yeah. they're also made in Great Britain. Made in Great Britain. Brilliant. Okay, that's good. We made like here. that. Sustainable and, and local. Uh, it is. Yeah. And uh, the more we sell, this is the whole thing about myself as a person. I want to give back to just just the builders, just to everybody. So it's not about making them dearer. It's the more we sell, the cheaper they become. Yeah. So, you know, we're surviving at the moment, but the more people we get on board with this, the, 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 the lower the price, the more we can sell and, and, and the wider we can spread. That's, That's it. the whole thing about it. But yeah, I mean, it is a fantastic product and there's no reason why people shouldn't use them. Right, so you said traditionally what you do for wrapping the ends of the beams is either wrap it or paint bitumen on it, which, like you mentioned as well, if you, if you cut it, you've then got to redo it. There's all sorts of extra work, but with these, can you just show us how, how easy they are? Yeah, I'll explain about the wrapping first of all. With the, when I wrapped them, the problem I had is because you wrap a DPC round it, you actually wrap over the rebate. When that DPC wraps over, you can't sit it the creates block. Like a, it a, creates, yes, yeah. and it won't sit in. So that's the other problem that wrapping gets you. With these, it's a case of... Straight on. Straight on. Your slips obviously sit in between, sitting between yeah. and your block is ready to go in. They can press on this side because the recycled plastic is very flexible. soft and flexible. Yeah. So by the time they sit in, they can press. And when you come to the top, you've got your, your DPC, line them up, and your blocks that sit on the top. So uh, they all hidden. compress. Yeah, the, everything's, everything's hidden. What we did do is at the end, there's three little dimples <coughs> that allow the cap to sit away from the end of the beam, just to allow for the air to flow. To just to stop it sweating Correct. or anything like that. Yeah. Correct. Yeah. Yep. 
Yeah, I suppose if it's fully sealed, there's a chance it could sweat and then you sort of see the object then, aren't 100%. You? So these uh, have now got the little dimples. So I think the dimples are about two mil. It keeps them sat away. Yeah, that's enough, isn't it, to get it out through? It is, it yeah. is. And as you said before about the wrapping and the painting with the bitumen, if you did lay them and had to trim the block, you've trimmed the end of the bitumen off. So then you've got then to it's a case it. of like, do you know where the bitumen mm -hmm. is? Do you know where the gloves are? You know, with this, it's just a simple removal, cut back on. So another good thing to mention about these then is the health and safety aspect because obviously building, manual labour, if you're shifting a lot of beams and blocks around it's strenuous on your body isn't it? So something like this obviously prevents repetitive strain because you just lift it up, slide it on, you haven't got to lug it around, wrapping it, doing all that sort of stuff. Yeah as if they're coming off the lorry, if they've been craned off the lorry as they're coming down to go in position just bang the cap on and, and lower it and even if you know I mean you have to sort of lift them again to trim them there's no painting, there's no of that difficult stuff that you normally do, you yeah. just take the cap off, trim the beam and stick the cap back on. It saves a lot of work. It saves it? a lot of yeah. manual labour, yeah. a lot of you know thinking and wastage and just time. And uh, people don't equate time to money, that's the, that's the, yeah. that's the really big thing on the site, you know, why, why does it save me money? Well it saves you time and your time is energy yeah. and energy is money. Exactly. So you know when you think of it, that's the, it's saving you money. You're looking at the long term, well, over the length of the job. You know, it's saving, saving your energy you and it's and saving your money. Yeah, exactly. You know, so yeah, it's saving you getting in the car to go and get them or whatever. It's just there. Where can people buy these from? Because obviously, after watching this, people are going to be keen now. The best place really is is to come to the website. Okay, which uh, is which is www.kcaps.com, which is k-caps.com. There's a quick quote and buy it now page. Okay. They can also go to Travis Perkins, Selco's, Juicens. So you're in quite a few merchants We're then. in quite a few yeah, merchants. Yeah. You know, if they inquire of their local merchants, they should be able to guide them onto us. If not, just come to the website and you can order the quantity that you want off the website. £20 delivery. If it's before 12 o'clock, they will be on site the next day. Oh, brilliant. Wow. Well, can't argue that, that then, mate. As simple yeah. as that. Yeah. As simple as that. Nice one. Um, you got any social media or anything like that? So We've got can... Instagram. Yeah. Uh, you can have a look at our Instagram and that's that's just K caps. We like to keep it as, as simple as we can and, and I think Instagram does the whole thing really, yeah. to be honest. Yeah. That's Absolutely. All the visual aspects of it, it. it. Correct. Yeah, exactly. Correct. Right, well, thank you ever so much for coming along, mate. It's been nice to see you. Nice to chat about your product. Good luck in the thank future, Thank you very mate. much Take indeed. Care, thank, thank you. you. Thank you. And thanks for watching this video. Be sure to check out Kev's social media and obviously buy these products and use them on your next job. You've been watching us from Build With A&E. Until next time, stay safe.